is fine. I'll ask you that in a sec. We're here. Oh, we are really, really tired. Let's do this. Around a bit of time inside the van. Air conditioning's on, nice and cool. What are we doing? Good morning. Good morning. morning. Where are we going, kids? Uh, we're going to Alice Springs Desert Park. Desert Park. What do we think we're going to see at the desert park? Bilbies. Bilbies. Uh, Lots of tropical plants, yeah? Dingo. No, the animals. Yeah, the All right, so we're going to explore the desert park today which would be pretty cool. <laughs> Mike is excited so uh, hopefully we can all learn a little bit more about nature and the flora and fauna about the desert which would be uh, I think quite interesting so let's see what it's all about. The devil's marbles, dude. Look at them all. Look at them all. Try too much. I can't handle that. That's too much for me. What? Too much for you? Too much. I can't even see all of them. I can pick that up. I'm not ready. Oh, and they look really cool. Look how big they are. They're like that big. They look really weird. So we'll see if um, they got space the campground. It's uh, after four o'clock. We did hear I that uh, it should be early for these things, but uh, we shall see. We had a late start this morning. So we'll see how we go, and otherwise we'll find somewhere else to camp for the night. But um, not before we have a look at these. Uh, really cool. All right, so we made it to Devil's Marbles. And uh, it's going to be pretty hard to see with the sun setting behind them, but there you go. Quite an awesome looking site here. Okay, good. But so we're here at... Uh... Oh, the flyers don't miss us either. <laughs> so we're here just after four o'clock. Yep. And look, there's still some sites available. But there are quite a few people already here. Yeah. Um, and bear in mind, 
yeah, this is all just pretty much local tourism. So um, you can imagine during sort of peak <laughs> tourist or backpacker season, this is supposed to be pretty well chockers by this time of the afternoon. Yeah. So. Um, and we did hear that, you know, we did hear that uh, this is the type of place you've got to come fairly early. Uh, so we weren't really holding out much hope coming here after four o'clock. But so we got lucky and uh, we got a good sight. So yeah. Uh, so no internet. <laughs> Good. That was the first thing came out of Michael's mouth. We arrived. Michael went, is there internet here? Yeah. Uh, no. <laughs> Just good. I'm happy with that. Yeah. So it's card night tonight which with the family, which will be good. No, it's been a while since we've done that. Afternoon. Hello. Afternoon. So yeah, so uh, what an awesome sight here. Let's go check out this bad boy, hey? You can see through the flies. Yeah. So we're pretty much, obviously, we're there at the end of the queue here. We're right by the toilet. <laughs> yeah, we are right by the toilet. I think it'll be a, uh, it'll be a drop toilet or a pit yeah. toilet. I'll use our cassette, I think. But, uh, yeah. Still plenty of sights up here on this side. Um, but unfortunately, the way the, sl the land kind of slopes away, it's better for us. And where our heads are sitting, to be on this side rather than the other side so uh yeah oh i'm gonna pull up enjoy a sunset get some food out for dinner and enjoy ourselves pretty cool here actually well worth the stop so now i just started talking shop to one of our neighbors so alice and i decided to go for a walk and check out the marbles mm. So we're just going to go on a quick little walk. Come on, Mama! Alice is excited. Let's go. She wants to see the marbles. They're quite interesting. You know, some of them are quite round and all rounded. It just make you think, you know? How'd they get here and what are they doing here? Yeah. No, we're not allowed to climb up the marbles, darling. Where are we going? Go this way. Go for a walk. Again, I'd say most people do these things sort of in the morning. But just get these amazing colours late in the afternoon. It's Where's just amazing colours. It's just there. No, that's the other way, babe. So just keep going this way. Very, very cool. So, after a long day driving, we've made it to Bitter Springs Campground. I'm so, so excited to day. go in the queue. Uh, I know. too long. Alice Springs, it's Bitter Springs. Mm, yeah, this is where we're staying. Yeah. It must be a little bit. Yeah. yeah. Alright, well, we're here. Oh, no, we are here. really, really tired. Oh, so yeah. we just come in, check in, plug in and set up and whatnot, and then we're just gonna have a quick dinner and hopefully try and get a much better rest tonight and go have a bit of fun tomorrow. A bit of a relaxing day. So I'll speak to you later. Good morning. We've woken up at Bitter Springs and um, we're taking the walk through the caravan park, I think it's called the Bitter Springs Caravan Park or Cabin Park, whatever it's called. Um, anyway, there's a walking track through the park to get to the springs and um, it is quite lovely actually because you're walking through a bit of a rainforesty looking thing and a creek. This is where we're going swimming, Alice? No. No? I can't even see under it, so it's not see-through. This is not the one? No. No. Because it's not see-through. Yeah. Kids are very excited. So, um, yeah, it's a neat little walk. Um, it's a lovely place, too nice and quiet. Just got to get used to the 
insects and the bugs that come with the tropics. So, um, you know, trying the toilet yesterday and frogs and there are um, spiders and stuff. So just got to get uh, used to that again, I suppose, being in the tropics. So, um, yeah, anyway, it's a lovely little walk and uh, can't wait to get there. Let's do this. Walking back down the uh, from the first run from the top stairs to the bottom stairs. That was really cool. But, um, water's beautiful. I mean, beautiful. It's perfect temperature. There are lots of all web spiders over the creek. A lot of them. Um, you're not going to come in too many of them when you stay in the water. But obviously, for little little girls, the little people, the big girls as well. It kind of <laughs> gets on the nerves a bit, understandable. So uh, we're going to go back in the water and give it a go again. Awesome. So we're here a bit earlier in the day, so you know it's not midday yet. It's only about morning. Uh, yeah, so we got in at 9:30. We've already been here for 45 minutes, and I have no intention of getting out. I'll be honest. It's uh, beautiful. All right, so it was. Uh, we just had a tropical downpour this afternoon. You see by the water, by the bikes potentially. And that's right. The bikes got all their dust washed off them, so that's pretty good. But, while we're doing that, and I'm picking stuff up off the floor, we are, um, we're having a bit of time inside the van. Air conditioning's on, nice and cool. What are we doing? You know! Playing you know. You know. You know. Yes, you yes, know. Yes, you know. The problem is that it gets very competitive. Doesn't it? <laughs> Somebody plays for sheep stations. She's a very competitive player. 
<laughs> and it's seven plus. Yeah. Not even her age. She's six. And so anyway, but I'm almost it's quite nice to get out of the humidity. We've been obviously in the cold desert, cold, dry temperatures for a while, and we're now in the tropics, so we're all enjoying a bit of the uh, humidity. Today's probably the first day we've felt quite a bit of the humidity. Yeah. And it was really nice to go for a nice swim down at the bit of Spring Creek or whatever it is. Yeah. And now we're just in the van, playing a bit of Uno, cooling down. And and I was uh, playing Yeah, so she's very good at it. Anyway, now chill out. Have some you know time, some family time. Mm -hmm. And because yeah. uh, it'll be now with that rain out there, it'll be very hot and sticky. Yeah. The way Maz loves it. No. No. I know. Mommy doesn't like that. All right. Morning. Morning. Yeah. to the pools we're going to the Mataranka Springs it's a bit busier down here it's a little busy we are staying at the Bitter Springs and so we went there yesterday to take a look at it and it wasn't it was hardly anyone there I mean, this looks like it's a little bit busier um, that being said we will check it out and uh, yeah we'll still give it a shot kids might enjoy this one so we'll um, I will oh. right, we'll get out and we'll um, Show you around, see what it's like. I don't know where they are. I don't know where they are either, and we'll figure it out. Yeah. All right, so this is our second day, or well, full day here at uh, Mataranka. And today, we're actually going to do the actual Mataranka pools, um, which we haven't done yet. No. We've been here a couple of times. We've only done Bitter Springs, so it's going to be yep. first for all of us today, which is pretty cool. Come on. So, here we are at. We're drinking alcohol right now. Don't, don't right. drink it. Thanks, we don't drink Let's any go. alcohol. Lucky you're not drinking alcohol. Yeah, we're just waiting for mum to come in. Oh. It's uh, just gone nine o'clock in the morning here at uh, Mataranka or Bitter Springs Cabin and Cabins. Now we're making our way up to Litchfield National Park, which I can't wait. I love, love that place. So I'm only going to stay there for the one night. Uh, sorry, we've just hitched up and it's uh, Again much like home was it's very humid and uh, sticky so it's good to keep a, a towel And a door to kind of yeah wipe it all away and keep yourself fresh Anyway, we're all hitched up What do you think of uh, Better Springs kids or Mataranka? Was it fun? Yeah, not bad. I like I like the tree. I like the green was that the best thing about this stay, or is there something yes. else that you enjoyed more? Um, no, nothing more. Just the trees suit everything about this place. It 
Man, you want to go here. It was good and bad. Okay. <laughs> the bathrooms have frogs, it's that type of place. But And there was a lizard when we were having Not a lizard. It wasn't a lizard, Alice. Was it a flesh-eating gecko? Yes, the <laughs> dangerous. <laughs> Michael, what about the thermal pools and springs that were here? I thought that was, that was the reason why we stayed here, mate. I yeah, thought... that's, 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 that's also, I like that, I like that. I like that as well. Just the trees, I love it. You like the trees? Again, it suits it. Mm-hmm. Everything. Alright. Well, there you have it. That's Michael and Alice's review of Metaranka. And I also like the pools. It's the trees that are stunning. <laughs> <laughs> um, but anyway, no, look, it is really nice. We went to both pools this time, so we're really glad we did. Um, yeah. We were just thinking the other night that we may have to swap, oh, stop and swing past and stop here on the way back down to Queensland again. So, yeah. Um, who knows? It may not be the last time we're here. Anyway, time to move on, hit the road again. Um, yep. We're going to stop in Catherine and get a couple of um, couple of food supplies, like you know, a bit of margarine and maybe some fresh bread, just yep. for one night because the next day we're in Darwin, so I don't need a huge amount. Um, and just topping up the fuel tank as well. So um, we'll see you in Catherine. Let's do it. Let's do it. So, before heading off, there's part of caravanning that's not always the fun part but it's well for those that have en suites it's a necessity and that is emptying the cassette now it's a very stressful situation having a cassette because you wonder do we have another night's worth before we get to Darwin yeah or do we play it safe and just empty out the cassette now <laughs> and uh <laughs> I don't know about you, but I don't really want to have a full cassette. No. So uh, I think we'll empty it out now while we've got the opportunity here at uh, Mataranka. So we've just pulled in behind uh, the water tower here, which is as a like a communal dump point for everyone. Communal dump point, that sounds really bad, doesn't it? It does. Everyone meets at the communal dump point. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> um, so yeah, we're gonna here and uh, do unfortunately, I do. You haven't done it yet. No. You've avoided it. I all do. The time. I avoid it. Like the plague. Mm. Alright, well, let's go empty out the cassette. Maybe Mum should do it this time. I agree with you, Michael. Shush you. I agree with you. Why don't you do it? Why don't you do it? You got some money. I'm only eight and I have no idea how to do it. Yeah. So what? Bye. Maybe Mum should do it. Maybe Daddy will do it and Mummy will be Maybe Mum should do it. No, I could be easy. Videoing. Oh, I can video, that's fine. <laughs> Alright, let's do it. Always keep handy, which we do in the car. Disinfectant. Always disinfectant. And that is unfortunately the necessity of caravanning. Okay. 